Haven't you ever wished your spreadsheet was three dimensions so you could select a range of cells across different worksheets? Well, it turns out you can. It's called a 3D reference, and that's what we're gonna do today. Here I have a workbook with Disney's revenue and operating income by segment. Each sheet represents a different quarter in 2014. I also have a summary tab where I wanna combine the quarterly data. Let's start with the revenue of each segment for the whole year. You'll start the formula like any other, equals, sum, open parentheses. Now click on the first worksheet that you want to include. Then hold down shift and click on the last worksheet. Now click on the cell that contains the data you're summing. Here I want C4, which has the media revenue, and it's gonna be C4 on all the sheets in my range. Close parentheses and enter. Pretty cool. Let's try this again to get the average quarterly revenue for each segment. Of course, we can just take the sum we just calculated and divide by four, but we're practicing, so let's see if we can use the 3D reference. So we'll do equals, average, open parentheses, select the leftmost sheet that you want, hold down shift, and select the rightmost sheet, which is Q4. Now select the cell or the range of cells and close parentheses, enter. Perfect. 3D references work for all sorts of functions. Sum and average, which we saw, but also count, min, max, standard deviation, product, variance, and some variations of these. Another important note, the range will include any sheets physically between the first and last sheets you select. Doesn't matter what you name the sheets. If you add a sheet and it's outside of these bookends, then it won't be included. But if you move the sheet so it's between your first and last, it will automatically be added to your range. Likewise, if you delete a sheet or move it outside of these bookends, it'll be removed from the range. And that's it, an easy way to add another dimension to your spreadsheets. Don't forget to subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks.